Hi everyone, Howard and Pam here. And Winston. And Winston. Say hi. And, uh, hi. Lindsay's over here. She's kind of tired. Uh, from your full-time RV living. And welcome to another edition. Uh, we have, one of our big concerns as full-time RVers is when you have the fur kids. What do you think? What do you think? Uh, what would happen what? if the power goes out uh, and it's a hot day, which in a lot of the climates we are at, that is true. What happens with the dogs? We don't have an auto uh, start on our generator, and there's a lot of RVs that don't. Uh, and of course, those that have uh, fifth wheels and travel trailers, they have their own unique set of situations. So they're really concerned about when the power goes out. But if it does, it does not take long to get warm in here. So we're really concerned when we are going 50, 100 miles away, going to be gone for a few hours, maybe longer. Uh, what's up with the kids? Uh, we want to be sure that they're taken care of. So I've uh, been checking out technologies and things, and uh, fortunately, because of uh, advancements that come out, uh, we have been I've been researching, and I found something that I was really excited about, and I've decided to try it, so I wanted to share it with uh, you folks. Now, those of you that are Amazon members or shop frequently on Amazon, uh, this is something that you can get very easily. And uh, I will include a link at the bottom of our uh, website so you can just click over directly to this product. But what we got is it's three cameras and it has a sender unit that communicates directly with our unlimited Wi-Fi that we have. And that will then allow us when we are out and about with the app for these cameras to be able to look in 1080p and see what's going on inside the RV. And we can set the cameras anywhere we want. But it also gives us temperature, oh my which goodness. is really cool. But if the power goes out, as long as I can see the microwave, uh, which is usually our best source that we have, we've lost powers. I can see that microwave. Uh, the time is on. The, I know that the power is on. And I can also just I'll be able to tell by temperature if the temperature is going up inside the RV. So then we can contact somebody here in the park, have them come on over. Uh, we have a key, and they can get on in and just fire up the generator for us so that they're taken care of. So this sounds all pretty cool, right? Well, it came today. Actually, I ordered it yesterday. Yay! And came. that was after we lost power in the park yeah, a couple we days just, ago. Yeah, we just lost power a couple days ago, and we've had water shut off and all kinds of things. And this is common in RV parks. You just, things happen. So you have to be prepared. Now, the other thing about this is uh, this is also a security camera. Uh, this can be used if you're concerned about the security of your RV while you're gone, uh, even at night when you're boondocking. Uh, it has clear view, night vision. So if you can't see a darn thing at all, these cameras will pick up an image outside. So if somebody's knocking on your door or hanging around your RV and you want to be poking around through the shades and you can't see, you can put these cameras anywhere you want. They do have mounts, and you could basically set yourself up so that you are, with your phone and the app, you can see all around the RV, depending on what you want to see. So this sounds really cool, right? So this has come in. I have not opened anything up. Uh, Pam just opened the box to be sure we got the right thing. We'd hate to start a video and find out, oops, wrong thing. So here it is. Uh, it came today. I ordered it yesterday afternoon, and it came wow. about 24 hours. <gasps> so pretty cool. So... Uh, we don't, oh, we don't need that. Don't, uh, don't, don't, no, 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 no. Hey, Winston can play with it. No, 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 no. Okay. No. All right. Bad how about, dad. How about the box? Bad, bad, dad. Dad. bad, bad dad. Bad dad. All right, so here it is. This <gasps> is called the Blink XT2. Now, uh, Amazon bought this company a number of years ago, and they had just the Blink units, and they came up with the Blink XT2, which now have allowed a whole lot more flexibility in what you can do with them. So when you read the side panel here, it says it's got two-way audio. Now that's really cool. We thought, you know, we'd like to be, if Winston's a puppy, in fact, right now he's in there chewing on his blanket. Mm -hmm. So No, he's uh, chewing on Lindsay's blanket. Well, he's chewing on Lindsay's. Hey, Winston. Winston. Knock it off. Come here. Okay, now what if I'm outside? I, you know, we're getting to the point where we need to trust him alone, but I don't really trust him. So I could be checking in on him and see what he's doing, and I could yell at him. That doesn't mean he's going to stop, but you know, <laughs> at least he can hear my voice. All right, so it says two-way, uh, two-way visitor, uh, two-way visitors through the Blink app, and this is also set up. You could put this on the outside of your RV at your door, and when people come to the door and you're not there, you could pretend you are there. Down. I guess. I don't know. That's. I know they're doing that for houses. Down. To your battery life. He's moving the camera. <laughs> Oh, Winston. this, that's, that's not going to work. Winston, come on. Come on. All right, well, okay, now I've got to get back in here. 
All right, let's see here. There you go. Okay, hold on. His big butt. Yeah, not too bad. His big butt moved the camera. His big tail. Okay, okay. All right. Technology at its finest. Here we go. Okay, so two-year battery life. Get up to two years with these uh, AA lithium batteries. Wow. We'll see how that works. No monthly fees. Uh, you're a, they do have cloud storage, so it's, the, the cameras are set up so that if it senses movement and you set up what zones you want to have. So you could have the top part of the camera, no movement, but the bottom part, yes. So if somebody gets close enough, it's automatically going to start recording and you get free cloud storage. Now, how did I know all this stuff? I did a lot of research ahead of time, so I'm pretty excited to get this. Uh, day and night HD coverage, I mentioned that. 1080p, that's pretty cool. Uh, what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk through this, show you what's in here, and then we're going to do, uh, we'll set it up in another video and actually show you what, how we're using it and what sort of quality we're getting. So we'll demo it. Uh, works with Alexa, if you happen to have that. I don't. Uh, so That comes with Amazon. Alexa. Yeah, that's an Amazon thing, so it can sync with that. Easy self-install. We'll find out about that. <laughs> All right, so here it is. Well, so the two-year battery, that's really interesting. Yeah, two-year, um, and I think they're either EverReady or something lithium batteries. I've mm -hmm. never used them. Um, usually they're too expensive. Uh, I don't know if they can be charged either, but it does actually have a USB charge port for the cameras. So uh, we've got our uh, cool little uh, plug-in port over here, which I'm going to talk about here in a later date. It's got a couple <laughs> micro SBs. There's actually six plug-ins there. That's our station for charging all the technology nowadays and that's actually where this uh, little receiver unit's going to wind up. Uh, maybe Pam you could throw that over the couch there. Uh -huh. Alright, here what we are go. We okay, here we are. Ooh, Ooh look, look at, at that. that. Are those okay. three cameras? Wow. Alright, so here we go. Here's the little cameras. They're not that big. Uh, I looked at some units where they were round and six inches long and it's like, mm, nah. You know, so let's see. Here's one. Now, I could set this anywhere. Hey, Winston, we're going to be watching you. You're in trouble now. Watching. So I could set this anywhere I want. Uh, they can be fixed, or you can just place them anywhere you want. So as we leave, just wherever we want to place them in the RV here to get the best view, we'll probably settle on uh, particular spots that we'll use. But uh, we have a shade up front, and I'm not sure if you guys can see it on here, but we've got uh, a darkness shade, we've got a, a, a sunscreen, and then we also have something on the outside of the windshield to keep the heat out. Uh, the bad side of that is we can't see outside. So, uh, you know, it's kind of a bummer. Uh, we can open it up each day, but we just typically leave it closed because the sun is beating in that front windshield. But we could place one of these in front of those screens yep. and also look out uh, that way and see what's going on. Yeah, just little uses for it, just right off the top of my head. I don't know. Yeah. So here's one. It could be a crate cam for Winston. Oh, crate cam. There you go. <laughs> it would have smooth. It would have smudges on it, lick yes. marks. Yeah. Okay, so here's, oh, each one of them. Oh, there we go. So here's the three cameras. Wow. That's what it looks like. Looks like the back is the mount. Okay, there's a, a mount on the back here. And with below each one of these trays looks to be a mounting unit. All right, so it looks to me like this goes to the back of this guy, and then uh, this guy works this way, and you can attach it. I guess the 3M sticky, sticky stuff would work yeah, pretty well with this. Go. I wouldn't screw it into the RV walls, but 3M sticky stuff. And here's the mat oh, screws. No, not using those. Uh, those of you who are RVers, uh, yeah, avoid screws in your walls. You don't know where wires might be running. But we, we like the 3M uh, the 3M stuff, and we also like sticky putty. Sticky putty. Like this stuff right here. It's just on sticky putty. When we drive, we don't have and to move it. And believe it or not, it does stay even through, yeah, look at this, the clock. Even through Louisiana roads. How about that? Okay, so these are Energizer Ultimate Lithium Batteries. That's what they're using in here. Okay, so each camera comes with its own batteries. Well, that's really cool. Cool. Awesome, wow. awesome. Yeah, what do you think? Huh? Huh? What do you think, Winston? All right, instructions. Oh, boy. Which guys never read? No, we don't need that. That wouldn't be any fun <laughs> to read instructions. Actually, I did download all this before we, before we got it, and because uh, I, I was interested in how you upload this thing and all and that it, stuff. And look, it even says a sticker protected by, by Blink. Blink. Woo! All right. Audio security. You think that'll work? Audio, wow. Think that'll work? Okay, okay. So here's the instructions. All right. So instruction booklet. Uh, not a lot here, so it can't be too hard. I think I could probably handle it. All right, so here is the unit that is going to sync with my uh, Wi-Fi unit. In fact, Pam, would you grab that? Let's. We could talk just briefly Alrighty. about that guy. Certainly. 
All right. So what Howard and Pam use on the road is we use a, uh, a dusty Verizon jetpack. We are in Texas. Uh, this is what we use, and this guy is a 4G LTE, 2.4 gigahertz response, and it's unlimited, no throttle. Uh, this was a plan that was introduced earlier this year. year about a year ago, maybe? Yeah, and it didn't last very long, but we took advantage of it. So we typically run 150 to 300G a month uh, because we uh, Amazon Prime and Netflix and working and uploading videos and, and uh, pretty much my business is here in the RV. So we use this guy. So what's going to happen is I need to tell this little guy to sync with that guy so then it can send the signal out to these other cameras so that we can open up the app and then communicate that way and see what's going on while we're gone. So as long as we've got internet power, we're good. Now, if the power goes out and we're on 120 volt, is this going to work? Not very well. However, there is a solution here. The uh, cord, if there's two ways to charge this thing. One is with the USB micro-C uh, plug-in into this, plugged into the wall receptacle, or we have 12 volt power, we've got two ports Right down uh, the bottom. Right, right, no, actually to the left of that. Those Are, are hooked sure? in directly into our battery system. So even if the power goes out, I could, my MiFi will be charged. It still will be running for hours, and this will still continue to run because it will run off the batteries of the coach. So we wouldn't actually lose any power. We'd still have our cameras running. Now, that's pretty cool, huh? That's way uh, cool. Isn't that awesome? Wow. Yeah, so we, uh, we don't have to worry about that. So, again, we, when we go out, we do worry about our pets. It is a big concern. And just like a car uh, that lose, you turn the air conditioning off, how long does it take for that car to get warm? Well, this has a lot of dark colors on the top, and the sun bakes on one side in the morning and one side in the afternoon, and it just doesn't take it long. We turn that AC off, and it, it's within, it's probably within an hour, it could easily be easily. up to 90 degrees. Yeah. And easily. That's, that with a uh, long furry coats that these uh, corgis have, that just wouldn't be very comfortable. Yeah. So that is kind of why we went along with this. Right. So. Here's what we have in the box. Now, I've already downloaded the Blink app, and it's just in Play Store. So if I go to uh, Blink, okay, so here is an Amazon company. So here's where I'm going to have to get started to set all this up. Now, uh, I will, I'm going to do a, another video tomorrow, and I'll go ahead and, and I'll go through this process because uh, I want to set this up and I want to show you show you uh, how this all works and we're already probably at about uh, 12, a little more than 12 minutes so that'll probably be the end of this video but this is the system we're going to work with, this is what we're going to be using and to me this looks like a great solution for full-time RVers, uh, part-time RVers, any RVers that you're not there but your pets are or security, you're parked somewhere and you just are not sure and as I said, we do a fair bit of boondocking, so this has lots of applications for us. And I've been waiting for a couple of years to really find yeah. something that I thought I'd, I'd really like. Yeah. And uh, this, I just, actually, I was watching Netflix and this, or Amazon Prime. Yeah. And, and there I was are, watching, yeah, I was, and I was there are yeah, other cameras out there that do inside monitoring, but we have not found one that actually monitors temperature. Yes. A friend of ours had deal. one when her Basset Hound was a puppy last year. She bought at Walmart pretty quick. She shows fifty dollars. But it was just it was just video. It wasn't heat monitoring, and she could talk to him, but he couldn't. She couldn't hear what was going on. So this is kind of a. Yes, that's that's what sold me was the temperature monitoring. Yeah. That really did it for me. That's that's huge. I mean, I guess I could have gotten another system and just pointed it at our internal temperature, which is over by the by the kitchen there. But I, each one will give us a separate reading. So if we have it outside or inside, whatever, it's giving us that information. So uh, I'll be interested to know if that sets off alarms or it's got that sort of functionality. But anyway, uh, any other thoughts? No, I think Winston isn't really happy about it because he's going to be watching. Yeah. Big Brother's watching yeah. you, huh? Guess what, huh? <laughs> Not only do you have a little beeping training collar, but you've got now you've got cameras watching you. It's tough growing up, wow. kids growing up in the Man, technology age, I you tell know? <laughs> but anyway. Yeah, the full-time <laughs> RV living mantra. Don't stress. <laughs> take it easy. That's what we're all about. So, All right, we're going to wrap it up for this one, so thanks for stopping by. Thank you. Winston uh, says thank you. And Lindsay. Check Lindsay. in uh, with us soon. We'll post the, the next video on setting this up and then also uh, demonstrations of 
us using it and how it's working for us. Maybe we can get a puppy cam in one of those photos. Yeah, that would be the goal. We might have to go over, to go over to Walmart when we're out and we'll just take the camera along and we'll, we'll video. Uh, we'll get some strange looks while we're in Walmart, but what else? You know, that's nothing new. Hey, right? it's Walmart. Yeah, that's nothing new. Okay. All right, y'all. Thanks for stopping by. Thank Remember, you. subscribe. Your full time RVLiving.com is our website, and you've already made it here to our YouTube page. Uh, subscribe, leave us any comments that you'd like, and we'll see you again. Bye. Take care. Bye bye. Bye.